an eternal flame in memory of the 800,000 victims of the 1994 genocide, lit by President Paul Kagame and his wife at the Genocide Memorial in Kigali, where over 250,000 victims are believed to be buried. At their side stand 32 visiting heads of state, including representatives of neighboring countries and allies. At the commemoration ceremony, the Rwandan president addressed the survivors of the massacre. We are in your debt. We asked you to do the impossible by carrying the burden of reconciliation on your shoulders. And you continue to do so, continue to do the impossible for our nation every single day, and we thank you. The April 7th ceremony marks the day Hutu extremists launched an 100-day massacre on the Tutsis and moderate Hutus following the assassination of the then Hutu president, Juvenal Habyarimana. The carnage was encouraged by anti-Tutsi propaganda broadcast on TV and radio and resulted in the brutal killing and rape of many. Today, there are over 200 genocide memorials and new mass graves continue to be discovered. During commemorations, music is not allowed in public places nor on the radio. Sports events and films are also banned unless they are linked to the commemoration. Across Rwanda, the next 100 days will be dedicated to remembering the events of 1994.